The project idea started actually with Jackson Family Wines because of their initiative, the Rooted for Good initiative, and their interest in transitioning to regenerative farming. And the FAR grant opportunity came up, and this is unique because they specifically support partnerships between industry and researchers. ARS is really interested in supporting long-term research and one of the difficult things about doing research in wine grapes is that they're a woody perennial crop and in order to understand the effects of the practices that are in the floor of the vineyard and their effects on the whole system on both the soil and the grapes and also the final product we need to do these projects for more than five years. And Jackson Family Wines is an excellent partner because they are willing to invest their time and their resources and provide their expertise to do a long-term project. What is regenerative farming? It's a field that is evolving really quick. One of the interesting things about regenerative farming is that it builds in practices that aren't new, like the use of compost, the use of cover crops or no-till. And the approach of regenerative farming is to combine them and stack in them one with the other. So there are benefits from that combination and there are synergies between the practices. The goal of regenerative farming is to sustain ecosystem health and specifically soil health. We're looking at regenerative farming for wine grapes from all the angles. I love our regenerative farming trials because I think that they're really um, exciting and that we have a lot to learn about how we can have a positive impact on climate through farming. If you measure the temperature of the soil that's exposed and that had been disked compared to this um, cover crop here, the temperature is oftentimes 30 degrees cooler when you have the cover crop. And so we're hoping that cooling effect is beneficial to us you know, across the vineyard so that we're not getting as hot in the vineyard as we would if it was just bare soil. One of the things that's really unique about doing this in a wine grape production system is that wine grapes are grown on every soil type. Wine grapes have you know, very specific production goals that are a lot more diverse than just looking for yield. We're really thinking about what we can do that'll be positive for the next generation. We really want to do what we can to set our company and our industry and the planet up for a healthy, um, livable future.